Hey guys, welcome back to the Pitch Preview, where we discuss all the latest football news straight from the source. First up, there have been several reports linking Arsenal with a move for Adamola Lookman this summer. Despite already sealing the arrivals of David Raya and Ricardo Calafiori, the Gunners are still active in the transfer market. Mikel Arteta is reportedly interested in signing a new winger to provide cover on both flanks, and Mikel Marino is also on his way to join Arsenal. Speaking of Mikel Marino, Arsenal could remain active in the summer transfer market after securing his transfer from Real Sociedad. After weeks of talks, the Gunners are expected to finalize a deal worth around £27 million, plus a further £4 million in add-ons. Real Sociedad proved to be tough negotiators, but a deal has been struck, and Marino is expected to be announced in the coming days. In other news, Arsenal have provided a fresh injury update ahead of their second Premier League match. Forward Gabriel Jesus has sustained a groin injury and did not travel with the rest of the squad to the Midlands for the Aston Villa game. Jesus has struggled with injuries since joining Arsenal from Manchester City, and he hinted at the possibility of needing surgery over the summer. Next up, Arsenal have reportedly agreed to loan Fabio Vieira back to Porto, two years after signing him. With the impending arrival of Mikel Marino and the continued emergence of academy talent Ethan Nwaneri, Vieira's playing time could be further limited. Arsenal initially saw great potential in Vieira when they signed him for up to £34.3 million, but the club has decided that a loan move is best for his development. Lastly, adding a new striker is likely high on Arteta's wish list this summer. Gabriel Jesus struggled last season, and while Kai Havertz impressed with a goal against Wolves, an out-and-out -out striker may still be preferred. One striker who has caught Arsenal's attention is Napoli's Victor Osimhen, whose future is set to be decided in the coming days. What do you think about these latest football news? If you like our content, don't forget to subscribe and we'll speak again soon.